this is the best, the global view is the best extrapolation of what we do know. And what we do know is that inflation, low scale inflation, seems to describe so well all of the experiments. And we are trying to extrapolate it. And I think we do the best job we can. And, and then it brings us some weird things. I, I do agree with that. It's going to be one of these Canadian things again. I mean, I actually agree with you that it's <laughs> <laughs> the global viewpoint is, is the most uh, straightforward extrapolation of how we usually do physics if you have the ingredients for eternal inflation in place, and that's very, very easy to have, um, then that's what general relativity tells you you're going to get. Um, and so, you know, why would you try to be fancy about it and, and then only talk about one causal patch? Well, um, I, you know, I gave my reasons yesterday, at least a few of them. Um, I think that we learned somewhere else uh, by studying quantum black holes that we get in trouble with the global viewpoint. Um, because we would apparently Xerox quantum information. Um, we, we have a problem in eternal inflation of how to make predictions. And um, so if we apply this restriction to a causal patch in this context, um, again, I think we lose uh, nothing that we needed. We still have the ability to have causal patches that contain all sorts of different things, including wooden Allen Guths. But we can now compare the um, probability uh, for for the wooden one versus the real one, for example, at least in principle. Um, so while it may not be the correct way of regulating the infinities, it's one that you get fairly naturally out of considerations that, um, uh, that had already been made elsewhere in, 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 in physics. And then finally, I, I also like it because it makes it particularly natural to get um, a decoherent history. But that doesn't necessarily mean it's right. I mean, I think ultimately, um, what, what matters is what kind of predictions it gives you when you do a calculation. Um, I feel encouraged by the results, uh, but it's certainly premature to say that this is the definitive answer. Out of what you said, I will only agree with one thing. We do need probabilities, okay? Uh, and, and I will formulate even stronger. I believe there is a probability space of the universe, okay? And that probability space will enable us to ask questions. Okay, unfortunately, I have to admit even the uh, global picture of universe doesn't give us this probability space yet, okay, nor local. Um, and until we get that probability space, uh, we just work under the best, simplest uh, extrapolations of what seems to work. And I think here we agree that the glo global point of view is, is the one. Uh, and so at the end of the day, I do hope that you win but not within the next hour. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's thank both of our...